Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it is ZipSapZop, and welcome to another channel update. Uh, on this one, we're going to be covering why I've been gone so long. I do apologize, I haven't put a video up in quite a while, but I'll get to explaining all of that in due time, and what's happening with the zombie campaign, and a few other exciting things. So, yeah. Um, but before we jump into everything real quick, what you're seeing on the screen right now is Fallout New Vegas, recorded from my PC with Fraps. Um... I can't record from the Xbox right now, and I'll explain that later on. But yeah, we're playing Fallout New Vegas, uh, the Lonesome Road DLC. We're fairly near the beginnings of it right here. And it's a great DLC. It's a lot of fun. I've um, been playing these two games on the PC quite a bit more since I've found out how much more I like them on the PC versus on the Xbox um, whenever I have the spare time. But yeah, let's jump right on in. So first of all, I haven't been able to upload recently for a, a whole slew of reasons, but I think the most important would be that um, my capture software, the HD PVR ArcSoft software, is uh, has messed up fairly badly. Um, I my computer crashed one day, and then when I plugged it back in a few weeks ago, I plugged it back in, and it didn't work. It just showed me a black screen the entire time. I I captured everything, recorded nothing, didn't work. I just got a whole slew of rainbow colors. I checked all my connections, everything was okay, I did. I updated the drivers, there was, there was no problem, it just kind of stopped working, so I figured, uh, I'll just uninstall it and reinstall it, it'll probably be fine. So, that's what I did, I've uninstalled it and reinstalled it since then, and now, if I plug it into the HPVR to update the drivers, it will crash every time, without exception. So, I don't know, I'm, I'm gonna work on getting it fixed, um might call them in and see what's going on, but until then, I can't record off of the Xbox, so that kind of puts a hamper on uploading things, and I'm, I'm, I, apo I apologize. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't really help that much, but rest assured, the zombie campaign's coming along well, and I'll upload Act 3 and maybe even 4 ASAP whenever my software begins functioning again. But, yeah. Anyways, moving right along... Um, the zombie campaign. Act 3 is practically ready for release. It's, um, finished, its structure is finished, it's been playtested once or twice, so there are still a few minor things to iron out, but I think, uh, just maybe one or two more playtests should, uh, do it justice, and then I can get a nice gameplay and do all the editing stuff and have it out. And, um, so I'm gonna try to get that done whenever I can, um, I've been kind of busy recently too, so that's why progress has been kind of slow on the zombie campaign overall. But rest assured, I am working towards it. And I will um, release Acts 3 and 4 as, as soon as possible. So, you have that to look forward to if you're still subscribed. I, I haven't looked at my subscribers yet. I'm, I'm assuming I've lost a large amount for not uploading in a few weeks. My channel's probably practically dead, actually, but, you know, that's alright. Whatever. As long as we're still producing good stuff, that's, that's all that matters. So, yeah. Act 3, in case you didn't know, is um, going to be kind of a crashed airplane map with a, a kind of installation base thing. Uh, I'm not going to spoil too much, but it's pretty cool. Uh, free roam map. And it is using a mod, I know, I'm sorry, the first two have used mods, and this one has also... And that's another topic I suppose we could delve into real quick. I'm using mods on pretty much every map in the zombie campaign because I feel like it gives me the opportunity to build on the scale that I want with the ideas that I want in a much better way than with the default budget because I feel like if, if this makes sense, I already have shown I can build a map that plays well, looks good, and whatever without modding and... um if you want to accuse me of saying I need mods to do well, that's not true. I've made Interstate 80, Station 92, all these other maps without using mods, and it's worked out great. And now I've, I just... it helps so much. It gives me so much more room to build and make things more impressive and more imposing. And gameplay spaces, you know, all that stuff is just so much more achievable when I have a large amount of walls versus a comparatively small number. So... I'd just like to explain that, um, if you don't like it, I guess that's alright, whatever. But, just enjoy the map anyways, even though you may hate it because it's modded, I don't know. <laughs> I was kind of stupid. But, moving right along, until I get my 
capture software working again, I will try to upload um, recorded clips off the PC. Uh, I'm going to be doing a few videos on Minecraft. I know most of you are okay with that. So I'll be doing a, a show around the server and maybe doing some stupid stuff on there. You know, <laughs> you can watch if that if you'd like. It'll be up at some point this week. And then once my capture software is back online, Act 3 will be out. And that's the majority of what I wanted to talk about. Another thing would be, um, in the downtime, uh, I've been taking a very close look at all my map submissions, and I've uh, scripted out a few reviews, so I have uh, some nice stuff coming up in that way also. So if you've sent me a map and I haven't featured it yet, you might just see it featured when the whole issue is resolved, which I hope will be soon, because if not, well, that'll be a, a big headache. But yeah, that's mostly what I wanted to cover. Um, if you actually wanted to be in a, a video, um, you could probably try joining the server whenever it's up and you see it's just me or a few other people wandering around just kind of wander over to us. And uh, yeah, so that's that. And in case you didn't remember, the Minecraft server IP will be on the screen right now. I believe it is, um, I can't quite remember, something, something, something. So, uh, it'll just be on the screen in the description if you do want to still play with me. Uh, I'll be around there um, more often than uh, being on the Xbox, because I can't do as much now. My ability to do stuff is kind of crippled. Anyways, that's all I really wanted to talk about. Um, if you have any suggestions or comments of what I should do or what I should play, I guess, in the downtime, uh, go ahead and post them. I got a few last time. I kind of checked them out. wasn't really a big fan of most of them, or they cost an obscene amount of money. Uh, so, yeah, just post some stuff. I'll look into it. And, um, yeah, I hope you're all still all right. I do apologize for the absence again. Um, it'll be back up and running as soon as possible. Thank you for watching. I'm the Zip Zap Zop. Uh, I appreciate it if you didn't un unsubscribe. That's always, uh, that's always good. And I'll see you guys next time.